Hello, royal folks. It's good to see you all here again. This is your regular dose of royal news and analysis. But before we start, please subscribe to my channel and click the bell icon. Thanks. Prince Archie and Princess Lilibet are likely to miss a major royal event attended by their older cousins in England this week, according to reports. King Charles III will celebrate his official birthday with the Trooping the Color on Saturday, June 17, marking the first time the 74-year-old will attend the historic ceremony as monarch. The regal spectacle, which has been held annually since 1760, involves a military parade complete with a 41-gun salute and a musical performance by the massed bands of the household division. It is also tradition for the royal family to make an appearance on the balcony of Buckingham Palace, where they are entertained by a Royal Air Force flypast while waving at the crowds lining the mall below. It's understood that the Prince and Princess of Wales, along with their three children, Prince George, Princess Charlotte, and Prince Louis, will all take part in the King's first trooping the color. Queen Camilla will also be present, along with Prince Anne and Prince Edward. Sophie Wessex and her two teenagers, Lady Louise Windsor and Viscount James Severn, are expected to make an appearance too. If you thought this might present an opportunity for a Sussex-Wales reconciliation, however, you may be in for a disappointment. It's now been reported that Prince Harry and Meghan Markle were not invited to the Trooping the Colour 2023, which means that their two children, Prince Archie, four, and Princess Lilibet, Two will almost definitely not be joining the reunion either. I hear that Prince Harry and Meghan have not been invited to the King's birthday parade next weekend, Richard Eden, royal correspondent at the Daily Mail, said in a recent interview, before adding, I'm afraid it's a reflection of the state of relations at the moment. The insight comes shortly after Prince Harry's recent trip to London to appear in the High Court for his case against Mirror Group newspapers, MGN. The Duke is one of more than 100 people who are suing the publisher over accusations of illegal activities between 1991 and 2011. So what do you think about this news, guys? Thank you for tuning in to today's discussion. As always, I encourage you to share your thoughts in the comments section below. Stay tuned for more updates on the intriguing world of royalty. Until then, thanks for watching. We'll see you again with some more fascinating news about the royal family. Thank you.